Hello everyone. Welcome to Indian Money's YouTube channel. I am Natalia. In this pandemic situation, we have to make smart choices when it comes to our finances. So in this video, I'm going to tell you some do's and don'ts when it comes to managing your finances. Number 1 do. Pump up your emergency funds. So in this situation, you might lose your job or you might even earn less and that sometimes you will not have enough funds to pay off your bills or your essentials. So at times like this, you have to have an emergency fund. Put away at least 6 to 9 months of your salary as an emergency fund so that in case of emergency you can definitely liquidate it. Number 2, control your spendings. So make sure you only spend on groceries that is essential products or anything related to medicine. Do not spend on entertainment or luxuries all that you can do it after this pandemic is over when you control your spendings you can save a lot of money and you can use that money in times of emergency number 3 cancel non essential subscriptions so yes netflix and amazon prime is really essential but is it that essential during a pandemic especially when you're trying to save money and trying to put away emergency funds so that in terms of emergency you will have extra cash So make sure you cancel any non-essential subscriptions and stick to free content like YouTube or Instagram. Number 4, apply for RBI moratorium. So in if you have a lot of EMIs and you're not able to pay the EMIs during this pandemic situation, then you can definitely go ahead and apply for the RBI moratorium. You can request the banks to hold off your EMI payments for the next 3 months. So if you're not able to pay the EMIs, then you can definitely go for this option, but only go for it if you're really not able to pay it. because this will increase your loan tenure number 5 take a loan to avoid any immediate difficulties so in case you don't have an emergency fund ready and you don't have a good uh, paying job which will pay for all your bills and all your essential products then definitely immediately take a loan a personal loan with very low interest so that you can sustain yourself through this pandemic situation number 6 hold on to your current job so if you have a good job which is paying you a good amount of salary then kindly hold on to it and if possible try taking up some side hustles some passive income so that you will be earning a little extra income number 7 check your insurance coverage so it's very important that you have a health insurance or a term insurance in place especially during this situation so make sure that you have a good insurance policy in place because anything can happen and if you don't have an insurance in place then you would end up spending a fortune number 8 do not panic and sell your stocks Yes it is very hard not to react especially when the stock market crashes but if the stock market crashes there's always going to be a recovery time so if you panic and sell off all your stocks then you will not be able to participate when it recovers and not just that when you panic and sell your stocks you might even face a capital loss number 9 do not go overboard with buying stocks so many investors jump in to buy stocks especially when the stock market crashes now that is a really good thing but do not make a financial mistake by investing carelessly look at your financial situation and analyze the risk and then go for it number 10 do not hold off on your repayments to your lenders so let's just say you are not able to pay a loan on time or an emi on time do let the lender or the banks know that you are facing some issues and ask them to extend your tenure do not uh, be you know without informing them don't ignore their calls but keep them posted because if you suddenly stop making the repayments then they will consider you a defaulter and that will affect your credit score so remember to make smart and wise choices when it comes to your money so that is all for today's video if you like this video and if you want to learn more about personal finance or career building courses or business and farming courses in six different languages then click the link in the description box below and download the financial freedom app and start your journey towards becoming rich and don't forget to use my code nat in 80 if you use this code you will be getting 2000 rupees worth scholarship absolutely free and if you like this video then hit the like button if you're new to the channel then hit the subscribe button and don't forget to use the bell icon so that you will be notified when we post a new video i'm natalia and i will see you guys in the next video thank you for watching indianmoney.com